Am I the asshole? For leaving my son's wedding after he denied his stepmom or mother son dance. My son Jordan is 27. His stepmom Natalie came into his life when he was 16. His mom had passed away when he was 13. Jordan never really considered Natalie as his his mom. He refused to let her get close and shut down every attempt to have a close relationship. He even moved in with his aunt months after Natalie and I got married. As years went by, they started reconciling and seeing each other more often. He invited us to his wedding which took place days ago. We got there and the atmosphere was great, until later when I found out that Jordan had denied Natalie a mother-son dance and instead chose his aunt to dance with him. Natalie told me this minutes later and I couldn't help feel irritated and quite upset. I decided to get up and leave and we both left. I got calls from my family after they saw me leave. And Jordan called later and I told him why I did it. He got mad and said it was his wedding and that his aunt is basically a mother to him and said that Natalie shouldn't expect special treatment. I said it's not special treatment but a tradition. Besides that he hurt her feelings for no reason other than for the sake of being malicious. He got offended and accused me of ruining his day and causing a scene. Now the family sided with him and said I shouldn't have left no matter what. Wow. You're the asshole. Way to make your son's wedding all about you and your wife. You already said that he never considered her his mom, so why in the hell did you expect him to invite her to do something that is traditionally for mothers and sons? For all intents and purposes, his aunt is a hell of a lot more of a mother to him than your wife. You are selfish, entitled people. Disgusting, and you should be ashamed. You're the asshole. I find it so hard to believe you're so surprised. This woman hasn't been mom to him. It's his wedding too. It's not tradition to dance with your stepmother. Extremely huge you're the asshole. A 16 year old is not going to form a new mother relationship. He oughtn't to be respectful and civil to your wife but that is the end of his obligation. You are a complete ass for walking out of his wedding. You're the asshole it's called the mother son dance not the father's wife son dance. You're the asshole. You made your son's wedding about your wife. Congrats on destroying your relationship with your son for tradition. You're the asshole. Natalie is just your wife. She is not your son's mother. It's not a tradition for your son to dance with someone whom he does not consider his mother. Don't force your personal decisions on someone, especially when it is his wedding day. Also, don't count on seeing any future grandkids very often, if this is your attitude. You made it clear you value your latest wife more than your son. She didn't raise him for the majority of his childhood his mother was there for that. It's reasonable that even if he likes her, he does not see her as his mother because he remembers and misses his mother. The fact that you remarried does not make your new wife his mother and if he didn't want to dance with her, he didn't have to. You're the asshole. 16 is way too old to expect a kid to treat a new stepmom like a second mother lol, yeah You're the asshole. Your wife has never been his mother and he has every right to not have a mother-son dance with her. I strongly suspect this isn't the first time you've chosen your wife over your son and is probably why he moved in with his aunt. If you want any kind of relationship with your son going forward, I very much recommend both you and your wife apologize for throwing a tantrum at his wedding. You're the asshole you and stepmom. If he never really felt motherly feelings towards your wife, why are you forcing the issue at his wedding? If your son felt his aunt was a mother figure to him after the death of his bio mom, it is natural for him to offer her that honor. You're the asshole. Your son only lived in the same house as your wife for months, and didn't interact with her during that time. Even if he didn't have an aunt that he's lived with for over a decade, there is absolutely zero reason for you or your wife to have your son and wife engage in a mother-son dance cross your minds. She's not his mother, she's not related, she's absolutely nothing to him whatsoever. If she's that dramatic and self-absorbed, no wonder he left as soon as he could. You already know you're the asshole. You're the asshole. His mother has passed, 
it's only natural that he chooses the next best mother figure he has had, and that is his aunt. Anything else would be ridiculous. He wasn't mean about it, he just stated the facts and went with it. I don't know how your wife expected it to be her, seems really weird. Tradition isn't to dance with the woman your dad happens to be married with. Even more weird is you getting mad about it. You're the arsehole he lost his mother as a young teenager. He felt you were replacing his mom with Natalie Hare, he was a kid he thought of his aunt as a surrogate mom, and it is his wedding. I am not understanding why Natalie was hurt and why you left. You're the asshole. Sorry but you and your wife are T.A. She is not now nor will she ever be his mother. He never saw her as a mom. Why does she keep pushing this? You have basically undone years of work in a few minutes. Edit added judgment. You're the asshole. There's no marriage tradition that involves step-parents. It's his wedding and his choice whether or not he feels comfortable including her. Clearly he didn't. Tune in next month where OP wonders why his son went no contact after the wedding. It's because you never respected any of the boundaries he tried to set and then just kept on with that pattern after the start of a reconciliation. You're the asshole. You're the asshole it's not up to you to pick a new mother to replace your son's dead mother. You got to pick a new wife for yourself, he had no choice in the matter. If he never felt that kind of relationship with her then tough luck. Don't try and force something that just isn't there apparently. Now you went and made his wedding about you. Good luck mending that. You're the asshole. Natalie is not his mother, nor did she fill that role in his life. Cannot believe you ruined the great atmosphere at your son's wedding over something like this when there was no indication he'd ever dance the mother-son dance with Natalie. You should be happy he has such a wonderful aunt. Pity, apparently OP didn't learn anything from being on Reddit. Demanding mother-son dance for a stepmother usually doesn't end well. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. Did it cross your mind that dancing with his aunt, his mom's sister, helped honor that loss in his life? You could have taken this chance to grow closer by appreciating his choice and why he made it, and had your own special moments with him after, but you were after one thing. You're the arsehole he has the right to choose the person he wants to dance with based on how he feels. You married Natalie but that doesn't make her his mother. By leaving you made it into a bigger deal than it was. You're the asshole, good job ruining his day and your relationship with him. You're the asshole. This is next level R behavior. You're the asshole. You are lucky you received a wedding invite because I imagine that's the last time you will be welcome to any event that includes your son. Since I am stepmom to three kids, I can say with absolute certainty you're the asshole. Jordan never really considered Natalie as his mom okay, so you answered yourself. So why in hell would he have a mother-son dance with her? You're the asshole. You're the asshole. You don't get to try to force a relationship and get upset when it doesn't work. Grow up and get over yourself. You're the asshole that wedding was not about you or your wife. You're the asshole, Jordan's mom died when he was only 13. Your wife is not his mother, and he will never see her as a mother figure. And guess what, he has every right to behave like that. You're the asshole, you're the asshole, you're the asshole. You're the asshole. Your wife is not his mother, plain and simple. Erta. You're the asshole. Stop trying to force the relationship you want him to have with Natalie. The more you force it, the less he wants it. You sound like you've abandoned him time and time again, so I would guess he's not that surprised you left his wedding over the entitlement you and your wife have. You're the asshole you can't force him to move on like you did without feeling he betraying his mom and accept you new wife is his new mother or whatever. Beside, you said yourself they don't have strong connection, and that he stay with cause the bond he has with them more strong than with you and you new wife. Damn. In fact you leaving his wedding, one of the most important moment in his life because you're annoyed must seem like you choose you new wife over him all over again. Beside, did he rejected her in rude way? No right? 
You messed up with your son. You're the asshole. It really can spoil the day for people when a relative has a nonsense tantrum and leaves. It doesn't sound like he sees your wife as a mother figure in any way. Your idea that he should pretend he does publicly or suffer your wrath is ridiculous. You're the asshole. Natalie is not his mom. She wasn't even in his life while his mom was around. He is free to choose who he dances with. But instead you blew away all the reconciliation you've done with him by getting butt hurt about this. He's obviously not close to Natalie. Why would he do a mother-son dance with her? You're the arsehole I don't understand why you need this explaining to you. His mum didn't pass away when he was three days, three months or three years. He lost his mum at thirteen. You didn't waste much time in getting married and then you thought ah here we go, pop up family, I don't need to do anything else. Did you even ask him how he felt? Are you so entirely wrapped up in yourself that you were completely blind to his grief? Do you really lack imagination? Your wife is your choice. She never had to be his and they were doing just fine. You totally messed up. You and your wife. You're the asshole, you can't force people to feel what you want them to feel. By disrespecting his boundaries you are making a clear statement of how conditional your love to him is and how you prefer the stepmom. Yes, it is tradition. To dance with your mother. Since his mother is no longer with him, he gets to choose whom he considers the second best option. Natalie is not that except it. You're the asshole. When Jordan's mom passed, he was a mid-13 and you remarried three years later. He needed a father. If he moved out upon the remarriage, something tells me that this wasn't something he welcomed. I think it's unfortunate that during his teenage years you didn't focus on your child's feelings and needs and rather focused on your own. Here you are, 11 years later, focusing on your own feelings again rather than your son's. You're the asshole. It's tradition to dance with the mom. Natalie isn't his mom you even said they weren't close originally and never consider her as his mom. It is also for Jordan to determine who is a mother-like figure to him. Yet you're upset over a tradition that isn't even a thing in this scenario as Jordan's mom wasn't present. In short, you made it about you. On your son's day. You're the asshole. You're the asshole you seem to forget that he went to live with his aunt after you got married. You indeed ruined his day. I am sick of people trying to shove their new spouses to their kids. You choosing your wife over him is why he dislikes her. Don't make another scene where he inevitably doesn't choose her as a godmom. You're quite the asshole. Yikes. You're the asshole, and so is your wife. Sounds to me like she thought she had the right to be his mom when he had already had one. And you did nothing to support your son as a teenager. The audacity of expecting to have a mother-son dance is truly beyond the pale. When your son goes North Carolina, don't you dare act surprised. God you're the asshole. He doesn't owe Natalie shit. Hope this worth losing your relationship with your son over. You're the asshole. How traditional a wedding is is up to the bride and groom. He didn't feel like his stepmother ever filled the mother role for him, but his aunt did. You don't get to dictate who he feels closest to. But he didn't decline for no reason other than for the sake of being malicious he declined because at his wedding it's his right to choose who he dances with and he chose his aunt that he says as a mother. Your wife is not his mother and forcing it on him has only had the opposite effect on the relationship. It doesn't seem like he was actively trying to hurt Natalie at all but to up and leave when you didn't get your way that really says something about you and your wife. It's not wrong to support your wife but this was the wrong move if you actually wanted everyone to have a relationship. But uh, his stepmother is not his mother. Which is as under tradition what that dance is for. He was almost an adult when this all happened and so he's allowed to feel what he does. On top of that stepmom just ruined her own relationship. Though now on to you. You just showed your own child how the stepmom is more important than him and how he feels. Don't be surprised now when you aren't told at all when his wife is pregnant. You're more than likely going to be cut off, 
because you wanted to feel upset over something that wasn't even an issue in the first place.